my team and I work in the manufacturing space. So we have dealt with and still do with a lot of what I would call legacy systems. How do you work with organizations from a change management perspective, moving from a legacy system to a more modern ERP solution? Hmm. Well, the, the processes have to match or at least evolve. Um, Legacy systems typically aren't as robust as what you're moving to. So there's a natural advantage to gaining features, gaining processes that should enhance the business. Um, hmm. Is your question what to do about it or? If the change management and OSA and Vicki, feel free to, to pipe in as well. But if somebody is on a legacy system and they're transitioning to something that's more modern, like in the cloud, there's a lot of change management that's involved in working with the different stakeholders to get them to adopt and use the, the new um, ERP. Yeah. Uh, stakeholder buy-in is key. If you've got everybody at least facing the same direction and then nodding and agreeing, get getting that is tantamount to success because the head leads the body. And if your stakeholders or management personnel uh, and they don't agree, you will have a less favorable time convincing the staff to adopt this new system. I have dealt with many legacy systems and occasionally they don't work. They don't work as well. Um, they do leave features on the table that they're not interested in talking with because their principal function is not performing. Um, I can think of a moving and storage company that had been two brothers writing the invoices out by hand. They had, yeah, they, <laughs> they had evolved into a small system that, you know, spit out the invoices, but they really needed to up the whole game because they were dealing with warehouses and drivers and, you know, people's belongings and studio props. <laughs> it, um, got to the point where I, I had to sit down the, the VP of operations and the controller and just tell them, look, if you want this to be successful, we have to agree on what you do best, what your priorities are, and what this system will do for you. Because they were going from, you know, a very small legacy system to Microsoft GP. Huge leap in productivity. And all I wanted to do was keep the balances the same. You know? <laughs> Just make sure that we bring over all the data. And um, what brought them comfort, though, was to have a, uh, a bookkeeper on hand who would just help us balance. That gave them comfort. You have to find out what the stakeholders are really holding on to and help them evolve that thinking and those processes into, because change management is mostly about buy-in. Once you get everybody agreeing, then it's your job as a consultant to make it work and don't take a lot of time. Delays build in doubt. So your change management principles have to include constant communication and efficient work. 